Hi, my name is Yasu from Japan, and in my video, I talk something about Japan in English. And today,、uh, I want to talk about the interest rate, the mortgage rate that people can get in Japan in March 2022, because every month, the banks and the lender they change the interest rate in accordance with what's actually going on. And that's a very good indicator of what might happen to the property price, because interest has huge impact on it. And in Japan, there is a few options that people can consider, including foreigners. But one of the major one is actually called flat thirty-five. Basically, if you use the flat thirty-five, then it's a fixed mortgage rate plan.、Uh, the maximum is for thirty-five years, and then the rate in March for flat thirty-five is one point four percent, which is up actually compared to、uh, February, but up by. Zero point zero zero five points, so it's a bit worrisome. But still, compared to what people need to use in other countries, one point four percent interest rate is too low. Or let's say if you just you know you're okay to use the、uh, floating rate, and then for example, if you work with a bank called Mitsubishi UFJ. Uh, that's the largest bank in Japan. The floating rate that people can get in Japan in March,、uh, that's actually zero point four seven five percent, which is the same as the February. So there now has been so much going on in terms of the floating rate, but there might be something because the fixed interest rate for flat thirty five in March、uh, went up, and then let's just keep an eye on it because. It would actually affect the、uh, property price in the future. So in April, I'm gonna make another video. So for now, jane.